Fooey's Small Stars, sponsored by Sanderson Ford. It's time for Fooey's Small Stars, and this week we're headed to the Ice Arena, where our Junior Coyotes played in the 19th Annual Phoenix President's Day Invitational Hockey Tournament. Get the Zamboni rolling and get the ice as clean as you can. This is tournament hockey. And as Tyler tells us, the Junior Coyotes have just one goal in mind this weekend. We're going to win today's game, and we're going to win the next game, and then we're going to win on Monday for the championship. Brady is the Oats' number one goalie, so I ask him what it takes to be a top-notch netminder at this level. On angle, uh, be where you need to be. Don't do too much. Don't do too little. and. Do your best, have fun. Having fun is absolutely essential. The ice is ready and the players are set. Time for Coach to give his team one final strategy talk before we leave the locker room. Relentless pressure, speed in the neutral zone, playing the offensive zone to support. Two guys on the puck, let's go get this done. As the game gets going and the intensity rises, it's important to remind the guys how shift changes are supposed to work. And change one by one, don't leave at the same time. The closest guy changes first, then you come next, next guy goes on. The Coyotes score first when Sebastian crashes the net, finds the loose puck, and with his back to the net, sweeps it in from his knees. Then comes goal number two, a shot from the point and with bodies in front Gino slides it into the five hole minutes later Maxwell on the breakaway he shoots but it's sitting on the doorstep and Tyler bangs home the rebound to make it three nothing Yotes intermissions are short in this tournament and you have to be quick with in-game changes and strategy if the play is developing this way you can jump over here for an outlet this guy fills and becomes an F3 sounds good okay Three goals, not enough for the Junior Coyotes. From inside the dot, Max rifles home the one-timer, and it's 4 nothing. It's never a bad idea to put the puck on the doorstep, especially with Landon waiting out front for the rebound. Make that 5 nothing Coyotes. Make that 6 for the Oats. Number 68, Orion fires the wrister, top shelf, with the assist from Landon. A fantastic offensive performance, coupled with great defense, gives the Yotes a 6-1 win over Crevo. Congratulations, Junior Coyotes. You're this week's Small Stars. And congratulations are in order for our Junior Coyotes. They beat the Houston Wild Monday afternoon 6-5 to to win their division in the tournament. And if you know a young athlete you'd like us to feature, send us your photos, videos, and a short story to smallstars at abc15.com.